Pop off Sammy and Allie Bug Channel. My bees, I've had them a couple of years and left them alone. And they have multiplied like crazy. Look at them. I mean, look at them. I, I'm fixing to take and split this hive. So I made a new box, top board, bottom board, the whole shooting match, and I'll split it. Hopefully the splitter works. That'll give me two. There, I went ahead and built a swarm box, a, a swarm trap. A, a nuke, whatever you want to call it. Now, if I can get, and they've been swarming lately. My neighbor across the street caught a, caught a swarm in the back right there two days ago. Uh, if I can get a swarm in that, then I'll be able to set it up and really get my hive split. But I shouldn't have any problems. Right past that shed right there, a guy's got three beehives. Less than 100 yards over here, he's got three. The guy over here has got about 12 in his cow pasture. There's about 10 or 12 in the back in different places. Then I got my bees. So there's bees all in here, and they swarm pretty red. So hopefully... How does the swarm box work? The bees, believe it or not, when the bees are out doing their little honey thing, they, they check out stuff like this. You'll see one go in and you'll come back out for all. All right. Now, when, when the mama bee, the queen, decides it's time to swarm, okay, she'll come out, but they usually don't go because they're maybe a hundred yards. And they'll go up in a tree or they'll, you know, tell I've seen them swarm on, on stuff lower than that. I've seen them swarm right at the ground level. When and they swarm, the scouts jump out and they remember these boxes. They might go here and a holler tree over yonder, a swarm trap over yonder, until they find one they like the size of. They'll come back and get the queen. Next thing you know, they'll be all over that box. And they'll be going in that box. Now in this box, I have made my uh, honey, honey trays, the, the uh, trays inside. And it's got old wax on it from the old, from my other hives. So you like baited it. Scent, and they'll smell that hive, so it smells bee. It smells familiar. The box is solid. Okay, except that hole right there. That's a cork from a wine bottle. If, if I do get a swarm, I'll wait till late at night. I'll pop that cork in there. I'll pick it up, take it straight to my hive over yonder, and uncork it. In the morning when they get out, they'll figure out where they're at, and they'll come right back to it in the afternoon. Awesome. These are smart. <laughs> These are smart. All right.